of the kind of basic rules of sales and marketing for SMEs, you know. So, um, you know, I mean, do, do they have to sort of keep looking at things like websites, podcasts, and TikTok, etc.? <laughs> I smile, you know, because I start any of my keynotes or any of my training with them. If you forget about sales and concentrate on relationships, the numbers will take care of itself. So for me, it's very much about a relationship game. You know, it's a bit like you reaching out, Keith, and me being on your show here. Thanks so much anyway for that and, and your audience and your tribe. We're creating relationships, we're creating content, we're, we're chatting, hopefully dropping some value for each other without actually asking for anything in return. We're just creating relationships, you know, and I really do believe we're in an age now where content is king. Um, and you, you know, we don't like these cold reach outs on LinkedIn anymore or these, you know, you know, these spammy cold emails, um, this scattergun approach. We really just want to have a good time and create relationships with integrity and authenticity. And that's not, you know, those words aren't dirty. They're just overused by marketers. You know, authenticity is fine, you know. Um, and we've got people like Brené Brown with um, Data Lead, was Brené's book. You know, she talks about vulnerability and, and shedding the armor. And that's great, especially from a leadership point of view as well. Heart on your sleeve kind of stuff. And that's where I love to do well. If you look at some of my content, my kids are involved. I'm very open about my mental health, my fitness, whatever drives me. So, yeah, I, I do think a smaller business has really something cool to offer, and it's authenticity. It's the journey, you know, 